Minnesota Fighting Vikings got a head start on their cuts, just like I said that they probably should. Again, Spielman watches this channel. Uh, so the Vikings released four members off their 80-man 80, 80 roster, as well as put uh, seventh-round uh, defensive end Kenny Willekes on injured reserve. Again, something that we said probably would happen. Uh, Willekes got dinged up at the Friday scrimmage at historic U.S. Bank Stadium, uh, as well as his prospects of making the rooster were actually pretty thin. Uh, maybe uh, they put him on the practice squad, but now keeping him on, on our IR um, you know, gets him uh, in the sphere for another year, another year of development. So we'll see what happens with Willikis in 2021. Uh, but the Vikings are also cut uh, veteran uh, defensive end Stacey Keeley, as well as uh, Anthony Zettel. Now, I thought that Zettel had a chance to make the roster before the Yannick Ngakwe trade. Uh, he was ahead of rookies DJ Wanham, as well as James Lynch in terms of the depth chart, the pecking order, getting some reps uh, with the third team. Uh, Stacy Keeley was the 2019 UAB uh, UDFA. It was like six foot eight. Right, so he potentially could be brought back on the practice squad, uh, just like we suggested that uh, cutting players early gets them through waivers early. So still TBD, I think that uh, Keeley could find his way back onto the practice squad. Also let go was UDFA uh, this year's UDFA linebacker Jordan Fair out of Appalachian State. A little bit of a surprise cut. I actually thought that uh, Fair had an outside shot of making the roster, but now this probably speaks more highly of a UDFA linebacker Dave, uh, David Reese the second, as well as um, uh, Blake. Lynch uh, from Baylor, nailed it. Uh, and then also, final one cut was running backs Tony Brooks James. So, Tony Brooks James, UDFA last year out of Oregon. Uh, he was initially on the roster, cut for a week, and then brought back into the fold. So, he, he could also be another one of those guys who, on again, off the practice squad uh, throughout the entire season. So, I, I think that it's not quite the end uh, for some of these guys. I think it's probably the end for Zettel. Uh, but TBD with Fair, Brooks James, and Stacey Keeley, you know, don't be shocked if their names pop up uh, later on in the season on the practice squad, or hell, maybe in the initial practice squad on Sunday. Sunday. But uh, I think it is smart. Uh, Vikings didn't practice today. They only have two more practices left. Uh, are guys really going to prove a lot in two more non-contact practices? Probably not. Uh, as well as with COVID concerns, get more bodies out of the building, more space for everyone, and, and just start getting dialed in for next Sunday. Not Sunday. Next Sunday, September 13th, historic U.S. Bank Sam. The greasy, grimy Green Bay Packers. Get it done. All right. So your thoughts, uh, Vikings cut four, move Willikis to IR. Let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Must support that work. Pull some of the Venmo. But until next time, Skull, production value.